Hey guys, welcome to my Enhancing for Profit series. So today I'm going to be showing you guys my attempts that made me a little bit under 2 billion silver profit with the current market prices, but also the current market prices are rising right now, so I might actually make even more profit. So make sure to stick till the end where I'll explain the math and how much profit we made in total. But anyways, let's get started. Let me turn on some hypey music and let's click this tent i feel the luck r and jesus is blessing us right now we got this guys channel your chi to me we're gonna get this tet our cadre tet we're gonna one tap it we are gonna one tap this cadre tet here we go Happy hands! Feels bad, does feel bad. <laughs> we got this, guys. It wouldn't be ideal if this turned to Tet, but it would be okay because we still make profit, so it's fine. Here we go, guys! really want that one anyways. Alrighty, we're gonna do our narc try next. So if this one enhances, take a look at my chart guys. Um, if this one enhances, we'll make a bill 1.3, around 1.3 billion silver once I sell it. So, Pockies! So we're getting into our high priced ones, which will make me a lot more profit than the other ones. So this is actually quite good. Um, but yeah, Pockies. Pockies guys, are y'all hyped? Are y'all hyped? I don't know what to tell you guys. This is actual BS. Profit. Y'all acted so smug. Just wait till I get my tet. I'm crying for you. Don't worry. I know this is real Pepe hands right now. <laughs> Ooh, Pepe hands, guys. Alrighty, let's click this tent, guys. 1.7 billion silver. Profit is on the line right now. We got this. This will... Enhanced to Tet. I just know it! Oh my god! No! No! Okay, guys, we're on to our Valtara belt. We're gonna hit this tet, and we're going to make 1.2 billion silver. Billion silver, do you hear me? Billion silver. Here we go, guys. 1.2 billion silver. Let's go. Great. So we could have made 425 million silver from that, but it failed, so Pepe hands. Ayaya failed me, I know. The power of Ayaya failed. Okay, that's actual Pepe hands, guys. Oh yeah, oh yeah. If it enhances to Tet, we will make, what is this, our second test? We will make 144 million silver, and I don't want that. That is not what I want. I do not want that. I don't want this one to enhance, but it's okay if it enhances because we'll still make profit. I 
I'm not sure how I feel about this one, Pepe Hands. It's okay. We still made a hundred, uh, a hundred million profit, so it's all right. Alrighty, so as you guys just saw from the clips I just showed you guys, we made a Tet Kadri and a Tet Valtara belt. So how did we make two billion silver profit? Well, let me show you guys a chart that'll help me explain it. Here is the chart that's going to help me explain all of this. So I'll have tax below me right here because in all my accessories, I have tax calculated out. So the profit we get is our profit with tax taken out already. So our first attempt, we made our Baltara Tet, which is all the way down here. So we made a profit of 1.2 billion silver after tax. So how do we get that? Well, let me backtrack a bit and let's go back to our first attempt which was our cadre try to tet attempt if this cadre try enhanced to tet we would have made 425 million silver profit after tax but it didn't but let me tell you guys the calculation of why we would have made that much. So we would have taken our Kadri Tet price, which is 1.5 billion silver, and then subtracted our fail stack price, which is 800 million, and subtracted our attempt price, which was our Kadri Try and Kadri Base. So 287 million silver and 8 million silver. And then after we subtracted all that out from our Kadri Tet, we would have gotten 420. 25 million silver profit after tax. So let's go back down to our Valtara attempt now. So to get this profit right here, we would pretty much do something really similar. So we would take our Valtara Tet price, which could sell for around 5.5 billion silver with the current marketplace prices. And then we would subtract all of our failed attempts. So our fail stack price. Kadri try, Kadri base, Kadri try, Kadri base, Narc try, Narc base, Crescent, Crescent try, Crescent base, and then we would also do our attempts, so Valtara try and Valtara base, and then after we subtract all of this from our Valtara tet, we would get this as our profit, so we would make 1.2 billion silver profit. And also for all of our accessories, if you take a look at the bottom of the screen right here, and I'm gonna click on all the accessories, all of them have tax taken out already. So the profit is after tax. So our next tet we got was a Kadri tet, which was our second Kadri attempt. So we only made 144 million silver profit from that. So these tet prices were the current marketplace prices for these tet accessories during the stream. So let me really quickly update this uh, and I'll be right back. Already, so I updated all of the tet prices. So here are the current marketplace prices right now so for kadri tet it's at 1.58 billion silver and before previously when i did the stream the kadri tet price was at 1.52 billion silver so it went up like a bit for our valtara tet the current market prices right now for the valtara tet is 6.16 billion silver and then before previously during the stream the valtara tet marketplace prices were 5.5 billion silver so so it went up 1 billion silver, so poggies. If we add our two profits together, so our 200 million profit and our Valtara Tet, which is 1.8 billion silver profit, we add that together, we get 2 billion silver profit in total. Now, if we subtract our 1 billion silver that we lost from making our pen grunnel that I showed you guys in my last Zero Pay to Win series episode, we get 1 billion silver profit. So to summarize that, uh, this pretty much means we made around 2 billion silver profit but then we had to subtract a billion because of the grunnel uh, pen that I made so uh, we made around 1 billion silver profit but anyways that's pretty much it for the video I hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to thumbs the video up and also subscribe down below to see more I also have a twitch channel called ace alpha live and my instagram is ace and lee and make sure to join my discord which will be linked in the description below and I also have a tiktok which is also called ace alpha live but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you guys later. Bye!